Hi, my name is Renee, and this is the Cougar News. <laughs> Welcome back, Cougars! Peace Cross number one, baby. This is the Cougar News. class president. I'm Renee and I'm vice president. I'm Pascal and I'm secretary. I'm Rachel and I'm the social manager. I'm Charlie and I'm the cabinet member. I'm Joy and I'm the cabinet member. I decided to run for this position because I feel like I am really responsible and I love to take the first step in every situation. I decided to run because I wanted to be able to support Esther and make sure our school year is really fun and memorable. Um, I wanted to run because also support these two right here and also I want to say have a fun school year. Um, I decided to run because I'm really interested in social media stuff and I don't know to get more Cougars to support. Yeah. I decided to run because I think I can help and give another um, opinion to what our opinions will be. I decided to run because I also wanted to help out in the senior class activity and what we're doing and have a fantastic senior year. My job as a student president is to advocate for the students and also be like a bridge between the administrators and the students. And my job is to assist that student in that role. My job is to take account of what goes on in the meeting. Um, my job is basically just to post whatever is going on around the school to the social media app because most of us students use social media a lot. Yeah. My job is to support them in what they're doing and also give them their opinion. Uh, my job is to also support them and also like plan out activities going on with the seniors and all. Our plans for the class of 2024 is to help um, have a memorable senior year. Go, Go Cougars! Phillies game in Philadelphia. I taught summer school and then I went to Niagara Falls. So this summer was the summer of music. So I went to several concerts, including Beyonce, uh, Usher, uh, Kindred the Family Soul. I saw Eric Roberson. I saw Stevie Nicks. I saw Billy Joel. I saw Avery Sunshine. I saw PJ Morton. So my summer was all about music with my family and friends. I worked at Ames Middle School, Arts Impact for uh, summer school. 
what you did this summer? Well, I had uh, three weddings that we went to. We had one down in North Carolina, uh, one of my n uh, nephews. Had one in Dayton, close by, and then we went to California. So we flew out to California and we're out there for 10 days and just had a wonderful time. So that would be the big things I did this summer. So I spent a lot of time with the marching band over the summer. We had band camp. Um, mm -hmm. Other activities included kayaking, fishing, Back. and just being outside. Um, I do go out with my family and have lunch. We go out to adventure parks. We go swimming. We go to Zoom and stuff like that. Hi, I'm Mrs. Cohen, and this summer I had a lot of fun. I traveled um, to the Bahamas, and then I traveled to Panama, and I took Spanish classes in Panama, and it was fantastic, and my Spanish got better, and I spent time with family and friends, and I, uh, let's see what else. Just enjoyed life. It was very much fun. Um, what I did over summer, uh, mostly football. It was mainly football for the night knows. Hi, I'm Mr. McLean. I'm the new ESL social studies teacher here at Beechcroft High School. I was asked what I did this summer. Well, I did a couple different things. I took a few trips to family and friends on the East Coast, and I worked a lot. Um, I'm not going to go into details of the jobs I did, but I had several. Some were in telecommunications, others were more local and nearby. Alright, so my past summer, I went to a uh, church camp, I went to the Arctic Fizz, I went to the pool, hang out with family and more. What I did this summer, I went to Kings Island and I hung out with my family. I went to Cincinnati and Kings Island twice. Alright, this summer I went to South Carolina, you know, where can't tell, where's how have a South Carolina. And what else? I went dirt back. Dirt bike riding. All right. That's enough. But yeah, me, I went to North Carolina instead of South because we we in the same family. But yeah, you feel me? That's my little sister. I went to South Carolina. I mean, I went to North Carolina. She went to South Carolina. Feel me? I see my mom. She seen her dad. And yeah, we been chilling. We had fun summer. Yep. What did you do this summer? What did I do? Um, I spent time with friends, but mostly I took care of stray cats. I've got five, no, actually six. So they're my babies, but they're not really mine. I traveled a lot this summer. I like to relax, and then I started with volleyball on August 1st. So yeah, it's been a good summer. It was a good summer.
Russell runs strong up the middle. He's still on his feet. Makes a cut. Still going to the 20. He's still on his feet. Running strong. Makes another cut. Can he get in there? Heritage Month takes place September 15th through October 15th every year as a time to recognize and celebrate the many contributions, diverse cultures, and extensive histories of the American Latino community. Beginning in 1968, Hispanic Heritage Month was originally observed as Hispanic Heritage Week, but it was later extended to a month in 1988. Since then, Hispanic Heritage Month has been celebrated nationwide through festivals, art shows, conferences, community gatherings, and much more. The month also celebrates the Independence Days of several Latin American countries, including Costa Rica, El Salvador, Guatemala, Honduras, and Nicaragua on September 15th, Mexico on September 16th, and Chile on September 18th. See you next time, Cougars! Go Cougars!